It's gonna get quite spooky on Rollercoin with a mega event that is starting soon. Let's check out all the details right here on that Techo Guy. Stay tuned. Okay, so a spooky event is about to begin on Rollercoin and you can get some awesome rewards. On my screen here, you can see the blog posts from Rollercoin, Fright Night Cinema, Get ready for spooky season. This announcement was made yesterday, so this is quite recent, and you can get ready for some nice thrills. So, hey thrill seekers, the abandoned theater is alive with whispers of anticipation, setting the scene for a festival. Are you daring enough to direct the most bone-chilling crypto scene ever? You need a cast that will make the audience's blood run cold and we're here with the perfect unnerving script to get you started. So Dracula is coming. Brace yourself for the ultimate powerhouse vampire set to conquer the eerie realms of expeditions. Fearless against any monster, he's your ticket to immerse riches. Okay, so mark your calendar for October the 27th. Okay, so October the 27th is tomorrow. So this is going to start Sunday, October 27th. How's the fest going? So cast your crew of 11 sinister stars by navigating through a series of spine tingling scenes from October 29th till November 3rd. Fuse it into any entity of unparalleled terror and power. So basically you're gonna be collecting a series of nine minors Nine spine tingling miners, and you're then going to fuse, meaning you're going to craft those miners like previous events that we've seen in the past, where you actually get a collection of nine miners and then craft them into one mega miner. Strive for the ultimate screen in the grand climax and capture the stride with the Lord of Dread, which is going to be 23 petahash in power with a whopping 8% bonus power attached to it. That is a lot of power. The final act of cinematic mastery will unfold from the 1st of November to November the 3rd. Remember the director's cut is in your hands. You must initiate the crafting manually. That's always important. You must do this manually between the 1st of November to the 3rd of November to get the Lord of Dread 23 Petahash Minor. After crafting is done, you will get the final Lord of Dread Miner and all nine miners, so nine miners that you need to collect, will be used during crafting and vanish from the room. And this is the way that the mega event will be split up. There will be three sales, there will be two progression events, there will be one puzzle, one craft, one burning event, and a new one race event, okay? So there's going to be a race tournament that you need to take part in as well. And this time it's going to work in waves. There's going to be the first wave that's going to start on October the 29th, the second wave that's going to start on October the 30th, and the third wave that's going to start on October the 31st. And here you can see the miners that you need to collect, nine miners in total, starting with October the 29th to November the 1st. So you've got a few days there to be able to get Chucky's Revenge. And at the same time, you'll be in the wave of the other miners as well. So literally on the first day, October the 29th, you can get four miners right out of the gate. So be sure to mark these dates down. Take note of this blog. I'll leave a link to the blog down in the description below this video. So you can make sure not to miss out on any of these miners, although you may be able to purchase them later in the marketplace if you do, but I'm not sure if these miners can be sold or not, okay? It doesn't say anything about that here. So Chucky's Revenge at 1.68 petahash. That's going to be in the Pumpkin's Revenge burning event. Leatherface Hash Cutter, 360 terahash, that's going to be during a race event. So you'll need to probably get to a certain position in the race event to be able to get that miner. Cursed Ring, 420 terahash, that's going to be in the Witching Hour Bargains Bundle Sale. And Ghost Faces Whisper, 480 terahash, will be in the Haunting Hour Progression Event. 
all of these events will be on at the same time. Some will last longer than others slightly, okay? Then we go on to the next wave where we have Gear of Terror at 720 Terra Hash, which is going to be on in the Friday the 13th sale, and Doll's Curse, which will be on in the Crypt of the Forgotten Puzzle event. Again, you can get both miners during the same period of time. The puzzle event will be a day longer than the sale. Remember that sales last for a limited time and there are limited quantities in the sale. So make sure to grab yours as soon as the sale starts. And all of these events normally start at 3 p.m. UTC time. Finally, the last wave is the Nightmare Shredder. 960 terahash that's going to be during the scary craft jigsaw's gamble 1.9 that's going to be during the jigsaw game sale flash sale and pennywise's haunt 2.2 petahash in the dia de amortes progression event okay so that's going to be the third and final wave so CZ scene, remember the curtain rises on your horror masterpiece starting October 29th. We'll roll out spooky community events and giveaways throughout the festival with exclusive rewards lurking in the shadows. Stay alert and prepared to scream into action. And one last thing, Pumpkin is coming back with revenge. Hmm. Okay, I remember that Pumpkin event from last year, yes. Its rage will rattle the blocks across all the roller coins. You will see for yourself, but we can say for sure, you will be able to earn much more crypto in this mess. Okay, awesome. So I hope that you found this video useful. Be sure to mark your calendars and do your best to try and get all nine miners to be able to craft that mega miner Lord of Dread with 23 petahash and 8% bonus. If you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, please do so down below, smash the like button and hit that notification bell to be notified when new videos do come out on my channel. And until next time, take very good care of yourselves and thanks for watching.